Assalamu alaikum, I am Faisal Mahmood Mughal and you are watching Faisal Mahmood Mughal YouTube channel. So in this today tutorial, I am going to show you that how you guys will be able to manage your uh, office expenses using the office expense excel sheet. So let's start from finding a template for the daily expense sheet. Okay. I do find some layout and let's start working on it. Okay, that would be the final layout as well. Uh, okay. Category description. Okay. Wait. So we can uh, get a layout example from uh, that area as well. And um, we can use them into our Excel sheet. So let's uh, come back on the Google. And uh, after this, I will click on this icon. And uh, here I am getting some other uh, online apps. And uh, they are also having the docs and sheets. I will click on the sheets to generate the Excel sheet. And they are also having the predefined templates for different purpose. I would be using a blank one. And I would be giving the name to it like Office Expense Sheet okay and uh, what i would be using like the serial number serial number details remarks in the note okay and uh, now here i would put the title like daily office expense yeah and here i will mention some detail for month or year month could be yeah month march yeah and year would be 2021 and uh, here i will mention the opening balance And the opening balance could be 25,000. Okay, now format it a little bit. I will use the borders for four sides, increase the size of this and merge it, merge all, bold it, increase the size to 18, center it. Okay, increase the size of this section as well, align it to the left, bold it, size 14, bold it, size 12. Okay and uh, let's increase the width of cells which are necessary okay remarks is okay detail should be more wider yeah so now i will put some assay uh, numbers i will generate them and uh, here i will put some detail like i pay fifteen thousand to the owner of uh, of a flat i'm just uh, putting an example so what happened uh, 15000 went out from my balance and now i will generate the formula i'll use the equal uh, everybody is very well familiar while using the formula in excel we start from the equal i will uh, select this cell and uh, i will plus in minus out sorry out and after this let's suppose i say that i get 23000 from a web development client in 23000 sorry 23000 and uh, now i have to put another formula i will use the equal i will say i will select that cell plus in minus out great and now i will generate that formula for further cells and that is it now whenever you will be uh, add some value and uh, you add some value into in and add some value into out it would be automatically uh, generating and managing the balance that how many uh, money is remaining into your office uh, expense area or uh, office expenses so it would be automatically managing like let me put something like 2000 there 
and it would be automatically updating and let's suppose I say that uh, I used 5000 rupees somewhere so it's automatically mending that and let's suppose when you will be uh, using for the next month what you have to do you just need to copy that and paste that here and uh, just uh, change the uh, balance area like opening balance uh, there is the column number 19 so f19 yeah and uh, after this it would be fine so that is it that is how you can change the month in it like there is a March, there is April, the next month will be April and that is how you will be getting for the April and moreover you can manage the dates as well like I will insert in column I will put date and uh, here I will merge it and in date you can put like 1 March 2021 and you can uh, generate for further search and double click to change the date so that is how you can manage the expense of your office and uh, your any business uh, moreover you can decrease and increase it to the cells because uh, sales could be increased according to the business and according to the uh, work. So let's meet in the next tutorial. Have a good day. Bye-bye.